This is crazy as well. A teen was charged with 23 felonies after allegedly threatening to kill Sheriff over Young Thug's arrest on social media. This is possibly the dumbest shit you can do ever. Um, I will never, never go to jail or prison for some random rapper. I could give a shit less. They, you know, they're great. Gave me great music. Yeah, a lot of them I like, but me going to prison or jail for them, never in a million years. And this is what this kid did. This is literally what he did. He's very stupid, man. This is why I say raise your kids, be in their lives, man, before they do some stupid shit like this. A Georgia teen is facing nearly two dozen felony counts after he threatened a sheriff and his family over the recent YSL indictments. According to the Atlanta Journal-Constitution, 18-year-old Quartavius Mender was taken into custody on May 26th, more than two weeks after the YSL members and associates were arrested for allegedly participating in criminal gang activity. Our thor- authorities say... Mender posted comments on social media using the hashtag free thug, an apparent reference to the now incarcerated YSL member Young Thug. The messages were targeted at Fulton County Sheriff Pat Patrick Labatt, his wife, Jackie Labatt, as well as the Atlanta Public Schools Police Chief. Free thug or I'ma shoot you and your wife, he wrote, according to an arrest warrant. I'm gonna assassinate you. Mender allegedly left the messages on the target's respective Instagram pages and also announced his intent to Labatt on the Georgia State Patrol's recruiting page, the Gwinnett County Sheriff's Office account, and the Fulton uh, Clerk of Court's Instagram page. Dumb 18-year-old, man. These kids, they think the internet is just the internet. You can say whatever you want. No, man, you cannot threaten the life Especially threaten the life of people, anybody, even the sheriff, like even celebrities, man. They can get people locked up for threatening a life. If you threaten somebody's life, you know, and you're you're consistently doing it, consistently saying it, you're going on everybody's page and saying, I'm gonna kill this person. You know, that warrants looking into something. Sometimes people don't get that's the, the sad thing is though for sheriffs to automatically lock the lock up the person. But for celebrities or any regular person, they'll be like, oh, it's just the internet. And then, unfortunately, the person actually gets killed. And they're like, oh, we didn't see the signs. Like, man, this person DM me saying he's going to kill me. How do you not fucking see the signs? So this stuff needs to be taken a lot more serious online. Especially me. I At one point, man, I got death threats over Machine Gun Kelly and Eminem video. Like, people are sending me death threats. Like, it's not that serious, man. Somebody's opinion is not that fucking serious. I'm not the... The he, I'm not the end all be all when I say something. It's not, it doesn't end with me. It's just my opinion. It's one person, whether you agree with it, agree with it or not, that doesn't matter to me. You know, where it's agree to disagree. I'm not a little two year old kid where I'll argue with you and want to kill you because you disagree with me. You know, it just don't threaten people's life over something so stupid or else you're going to get locked up or it just, it's, it's dumb and it doesn't do anything to progress society. You're not doing anything great doing it. It doesn't make you tough. You know, I've gotten to arguments with people, you know, that threatened me. I'm like, bro, like wh- we're having debates. That's all we're doing. This has nothing. I didn't attack you personally. I didn't attack your kids. I didn't attack your family. We're just debating on music sometimes. Most of the time, it's 90% of the time it's that. And people will just go off the rails and be like, man, fuck you, this and that. Go kill yourself. All kinds of shit, man. It's just, this guy's 18 years old. Hopefully they didn't, they didn't I don't know what how much sentence they're giving him, what's the sentencing, but they're going to sentence him. 23 felony counts is insane. With terroristic threats, online records show he remains in Fulton County Jail without bond. They're not even giving this kid bond. They said, we take these kinds of brazen threats seriously, Labatt said in a statement to AJC. Social media, cyberbullying, and hiding behind a keyboard will not protect someone from criminal prosecution. Now, if you're going to troll like this, I don't even know if he was trolling or being serious, but if you're going to say shit like this, try to get a burner account and try to do it in a way where it's like impossible to track you with, with VPNs. Even then they can still track you for the most part, but don't do it on your main account and just start threatening people. Like that's at least if you're going to threaten, don't even threaten. First off, I'm not condoning it. I'm just saying, be smarter. If you're going to do some stupid shit like that, it's not worth it, man. Take your time, do something better with your day. These rappers don't give a shit about you. Let's be honest. Majority of them don't give a fuck. They don't even know who you are. You're over here wasting your whole life, threatening people, Ah, uh, just stupid, man. Stupid, stupid. Hopefully he learns his lesson and never does it again. 